you have a blog, you're writing all these pieces of content, but you know what? No one's going to read it. Why? Because you're not doing what I'm about to teach you right now. Hey everyone, I'm Neil Patel, and today I'm going to share with you how to generate more blog traffic using LinkedIn. LinkedIn is one of the best social networks out there, especially if you're in the B2B niche. LinkedIn's way better than Facebook and Twitter for B2B. It has your ideal customers on there. And you're not getting them. You may be getting some visitors to your blog, but they're probably not converting into customers. And it's because you're not leveraging LinkedIn. The first thing you need to do is connect with other people within your space on LinkedIn. I'm a marketer. If you look at most of my connections, they're business owners and marketers. That means they're my potential customers or they're within my field and they can promote it to other people who are following them. And the cool part about LinkedIn is you can have up to 30,000 connections. Once you hit 30,000 connections like me, sadly, they cap you out. If it was up to me, I would say they should just make it unlimited because I want more traffic from LinkedIn. But for now, 30,000 is enough. So now that you got thousands of followers, what you want to do is the second step is post your content on LinkedIn. See, if you just click the share icon within your blog post, like on the Neil Patel blog, in my sidebar, or as you're scrolling, you'll see LinkedIn social sharing icons. And if you click that, it doesn't really help me generate that much traffic. But what does help me generate way more traffic is when I take my content, put it on LinkedIn, and only put the first few paragraphs on LinkedIn, and then have a click to continue reading link. By having that, I'm getting thousands of visitors from LinkedIn per day right now. Isn't that crazy? Before, I wasn't even getting more than a few thousand visitors from LinkedIn, and now I'm getting over a thousand visitors a day. It's that big of a difference. And all I'm doing is just putting the first few paragraphs and then putting click to continue reading and that drives people to my website. Of course, the third tip, and I kind of cover this, have the LinkedIn social sharing button on your blog post. It doesn't hurt, it doesn't help a lot to be quite frank, but again, it doesn't hurt. Something's better than nothing. And last but not least, when you're sending out your email blasts, because every time I release a blog post, I at least tell people through my email list, hey, go check out this post. You can put in a PS at the bottom of your email and tell them to share it on LinkedIn. Combine all those strategies, you'll get more traffic from LinkedIn, and better yet, you'll get more leads and sales. Because LinkedIn has some of the best traffic out there, especially if you're in the B2B niche.